some TikTok users now started to destroy their Balenciaga items. As an entrepreneur and content creator that has helped marketing agencies, I knew something was up with this Balenciaga lawsuit. First of all, when a client has an idea, they call a marketing or an advertising agency. They clearly let the agency know what their vision is for a marketing campaign. The marketing agency is then contracted to come up with ideas. It could be a 3D design. It could be uh, an actual setup in a studio and a photo sent to the, the actual client. Or it can even just be a draft drawing of what they would like to do next. After that's sent to the client, the client then accepts, approves, makes changes on what they want to see in their campaign. I'm not saying in this particular case, but quite often these first drafts or second or third drafts can also be sent to upper management or the executive team for approval as well. Once that's approved, it's sent to the advertising agency and either the client and or the agency get you know photographers and they all work together uh, to find modeling agencies etc you know the deal but the fact that they actually try to take the heat off of themselves and blame the marketing advertising agency is ridiculous so let me know what you all think in the comments do you think that this was some kind of a way to uh, get people off of their back so that they can point blame or do you think that they had a good enough reason to point the finger at the agency? Let me know what you think in the comments and follow from our marketing, branding, business, influencer, and celebrity commentary.